In this video we will understand Unit 4 Affective Processes Motivation and Emotions Here we will study Motivation Types of Motivations Theories of Motivation Emotions Components of Emotions Functions of Emotions and at last Theories of Emotions Let's start 1. Introduction Jack Ma Also known as Ma Yun is a self-made billionaire and the richest person in China. However, he faced multiple failures in his early life and education, including failing primary and middle school exams, and failing university entrance exams multiple times. Jack Ma even applied to Harvard University 10 times and was rejected each time. After finally getting into university, he struggled to find a job, facing rejection 30 times. Despite these failures, Jack Ma persisted and eventually succeeded in his entrepreneurial endeavors. 2. Motivation Motivation is the reason behind a person's actions, providing purpose and direction to their behavior. It answers the question why someone behaves in a particular way. The term motivation is derived from the Latin word movere, meaning to move. Various definitions of motivation highlight its role in energizing and directing behavior. 3. Types of motivations. Motivation can be categorized into primary and secondary motivations. Primary motivations are related to basic biological needs like hunger, thirst, and safety. Secondary motivations are more individualized and related to personal goals and values. Another classification is extrinsic and intrinsic motivation. Extrinsic motivation comes from external factors like rewards or praise. Intrinsic motivation comes from within and is driven by factors like enjoyment, mastery, and autonomy. 4. Theories of Motivation there are several theories explaining motivation. Instinct theory, early theories attributed behavior to instincts. But this idea was later challenged by the role of learning in environmental factors. Drive reduction theory. This theory suggests that motivation arises from the need to reduce internal physiological imbalances. Arousal theory. It states that people are motivated to maintain an optimal level of physiological arousal. Incentive theory, motivation is driven by external stimuli or incentives. Maslow's hierarchy of needs, Maslow's theory suggests that human needs are arranged in a hierarchy, with basic needs at the bottom and self-actualization at the top. McClellan's acquired needs theory, this theory highlights the three basic needs, achievement, affiliation, and power. 5. Emotions. Emotions are complex reactions that involve physiological responses, subjective feelings, and expressive behaviors. Emotions play a vital role in behavior and have physiological, cognitive, and behavioral components. Emotions are subjective experiences that result from cognitive appraisal of a situation's personal meaning. There are various types of emotions, including basic emotions like anger, happiness, fear, etc., and self-conscious emotions like embarrassment, guilt, etc. 6. Components of emotions. Emotions consist of six main components. Cognitive appraisal, the situation is assessed based on personal meaning. Subjective experience, emotions involve feelings. Thought and action tendencies, emotions lead to specific thoughts and behaviors. Internal bodily changes, physiological reactions are part of emotional experiences. Facial expressions, emotions often manifest in facial expressions. Response to emotion, how individuals cope and react to their emotions. 7. Functions of emotions. Emotions serve several functions. Prepare for action. Emotions prepare individuals to react to situations. Shape future behavior. Emotions influence learning and behavior. Enhance social interactions. 
Emotions help in effective communication with others. 8. Theories of Emotions There are several theories explaining the nature of emotions. James Lang Theory It suggests that emotions are a response to physiological changes caused by external events. Canon Bard Theory This theory proposes that emotions and physiological changes occur simultaneously. Schachter Singer Theory it's a two-factor theory stating that emotions result from physiological arousal and cognitive appraisal. Opponent Process Theory This theory suggests that emotions are followed by opposite reactions. Cognitive Appraisal Theory Emotions result from the cognitive appraisal of information from the environment and within the body. Reappraisal can also change emotional experiences. So, here we studied, motivation, types of motivations, theories of motivation, emotions, components of emotions, functions of emotions and at last theories of emotions.